name is Jack Voigt. I'm an environmental engineer, and I am going to a junior year of college. My professor, I was at working with him, and he just suggested maybe that I partake and, you know, come work full time in the summer. And it's an opportunity to, like, do research and get paid to do so, and, uh, you know, really dive into some topics that I don't really get a chance to work on during my normal school year. So it just seemed like a good opportunity to come out, stay out here in Raleigh, and work on something I'm passionate about. I'm working on the coastal and computational hydraulics team with Dr. Dietrich and a couple of his grad students. Um, it's mostly just coding work with like Python, Linux, but it's all about uh, forecasting hurricanes and hindcasting hurricanes, so before and after the storms pass through. And a lot of what we're doing is working on like increasing or decreasing computational costs, which is just a fancy way to say making it faster. It's really important for like the news and these emergency teams that work in coastal engineering. And when a hurricane comes through, you know, lives are affected. You know, from a community myself, like that's at the beach. I've that's something I've always been kind of aware of. And it was just cool to be able to jump into a team where I'm kind of working on stuff that's directly going to impact that. It's really exciting and I'm excited to be working with all the great people in the coastal engineering lab. Coming into environmental engineering, I just thought it was like an interesting subsect of civil, maybe getting me involved with some more stuff I care about because I've been from the beach and I've always kind of just loved the outdoors, water. This program has allowed me to kind of just dive full force in the coastal engineering and get real experience of what it's like and maybe consider going to a master's program for coastal engineering.